Well, after months of working to stop the spread of the coronavirus, a physician who actually works for the Department of Health and Environmental Control is now unfortunately mourning the loss of her own grandmother who did die from COVID-19. She shared her story with our own News 19's Jenna Kurzina. It hit me personally. DHEC physician Brandon Traxler has been working for months to help stop the spread of the coronavirus. Even physicians at DHEC are not immune, you know, to the effects of COVID. And while she continues to fight to protect others, she's now mourning the loss of a loved one. My grandmother, um, Mimi, um, died of COVID-19 in May, in early May, on May 7th. Traxler says her grandmother, Betty Traxler, died one week after contracting the virus. She had no underlying health conditions and was a few days shy of her 98th birthday. We all felt very strongly that if something good can come out of something bad, we want it to. If one person sees my story and, you know, makes a decision to change their behavior, um, and then, you know, that is likely saving sickness and, and saving people from death, then it's worth it. And that is why Traxler is sharing her story. I want to, to honor her basically by doing everything I can to stop it from spreading to other people and having other folks impacted like this. As Traxler continues to work to honor her Mimi, she also hopes no other family has to lose a loved one from this virus. This is very real. Um, these numbers that we are reporting right now are very concerning and each one of those, you know, more than a thousand, sometimes more than 2000 people that we're reporting each day is somebody's loved one and each one of those deaths, which are sometimes in the 20s each day is somebody's loved one. In Columbia, Jenna Corzina, News 19, WLTX. Well, Traxler said she decided to share her story because she hopes it helps just one person out there. And she says, please take this virus seriously, practice social distancing, and always wear your masks.